A typical defense against DDoS is for company to buy more servers or bandwidth. However, DDoS attacks can be amplified to make such defense very, very expensive. Here's one example. On the internet, there are many so-called open recursive DNS servers. These are DNS servers that any machine on the internet can query. A typical DNS query is to look up the IP address of a domain name. But DNS also allows query for the so-called large TXT record of a domain that includes a lot of details of the domain, even including organizational description and information, and so on. The point is that the size of the query response can be more than 1,500 bytes. So here's how this amplified distributed reflective attack works. The attacker instructs the bots to query the open recursive DNS servers on the internet, and in the query, the source of the query is spoofed as victim's IP, meaning that the response will be sent back to the victim instead of to the bot. And the query itself is for the large TXT record. Because the query is for the large TXT record, the response will be at least 1,500 bytes. And again, because the query is spoofed as from the victim, the response will be sent to the victim. Because there are many bots and each bot can query multiple recursive DNS servers, the victim as a result will get many, many responses, each with at least 1,500 bytes. Therefore, with just a couple thousand bots participating in the attack, the victim can get several gigabytes of traffic.